Hello, I'm Auntie Dana, and I want to share something really important with you. Have you heard about Orange Shirt Day and Every Child Matters? So the residential schools, um, when children are very young, they made the children live in the schools, and a lot of them were um, scared and they didn't know what was going on. So we want to remember them to make sure it never happens again. And listen to this. We give a heartbeat to ones who never made it home. Now I recently learned you can do all kinds of different things with the drum. You can make raindrops the rain's falling. You can make wind. Shh, right? And you can make fire, right? An urgency. So today we're going to learn a little bit more about indigenous children and a happy time that says my heart fills with happiness. Now what we'll read in here about the indigenous culture is how every child should have gotten gotten to learn about how they should have grown up because they were born. My Heart Fills with Happiness, Monique Grace Smith, illustrations by Julie Flett. You can see it there. Oh wow, check it out. Ah! So she's got her arms open for receiving. Mm -hmm. Receiving. That's why the heart fills with happiness. My heart fills with happiness when I see the face of someone I love. Aww. And whether it's a mom or an aunt or a grandma, a caregiver. Oh, I smell bannock baking in the oven. Look at that. So bannock is, um, if you never had it, you can think of it like uh, fry bread. I found a recipe for baked bannock. Um, most people, I think, that when I've had it, they fry it. But in this story, they have theirs in the oven. So I'm going to talk to you about the baked kind. You can take three cups of flour, two tablespoons of baking powder, a quarter of a cup vegetable oil, one and a half cups of water, and a pinch of salt. You're going to preheat the oven to 400 Fahrenheit. So mix all those ingredients together in a large bowl, knead and spread out on a cookie sheet. Okay, so knead means you're gonna take the dough out and you're just gonna push it with your hand, your clean hands, maybe some flour on there. And that way the rest of the flour of the dough part is gonna mix in good. Okay, so you're gonna knead it and then you're gonna spread it out on a cookie sheet. Right, so spread it, tap, 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 and then poke, poke some holes with a fork, and then it's going to bake for 15 to 20 minutes, and it's going to smell so good, just like those kids are waiting. My heart fills with happiness when I sing. Mm -hmm. You like to sing too? Hmm. My heart fills with happiness when you come and visit me, when I come and visit you, we'll love the world through, right? My heart fills with happiness when I feel the sun dancing on my cheeks. Oh, and that's like at the beginning of the story, just taking the sun. I walk barefoot on the grass. Have you ever done that? Um, you wanna make sure there's not like glass in the grass or it's really dirty, maybe dog pee or something, right? So make sure it's a clean area and you can feel with your bare feet, feel the earth. My heart fills with happiness when I dance. Oh, 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 yes. 
there are dances called like a powwow um, a celebration and oh man um, look it up on YouTube and it's just incredible the costumes and how committed everyone is when they're dancing my heart fills with happiness when I hold the hand of someone I love going for a walk do you feel that way too I listen to stories oh look at that they have their aunt or grandma doing that yeah hmm. my heart fills with happiness when I drum oh they've got a nice big drum there look at that look at that okay you can make words with the drum too you can go my heart fills with happiness my heart fills with happiness <laughs> you can make it however you want it if you have the chance mm -hmm. what fills your heart with happiness oh look at it she's happy just being herself oh wow so there is a kid on a grandpa's and uncle's or someone's shoulder and they're looking at oh a whale whale in the ocean that would be something wouldn't it yes. all right so this is a nice story it introduces us to um indigenous culture um some people say first nations um some people say native um we want to keep in mind and always honor pink shirt day my shirt comes um an exclusive design from sisters gifts out of newfoundland i'll put that link in the description and it just feels really special to wear it <laughs> thanks everybody please take care and remember the children <laughs>